Hey everyone, it's just an explorer. We're heading back down to Nottingham Goose Fair. Let's do a walk through and see what it's like before the fair opens. So, let's do this. Here yeah, I am just walking along Gregory Boulevard. It's not fantastic weather today. Well, it, it's okay at the moment, but it's due to rain when the fair starts, which is pretty typical. Although the rest of the week is looking not looking too bad. As of filming, it is Monday the 2nd of October. The fair doesn't open until four o'clock today. It's just gone two. So we're gonna take a walk down, show you what it's like without all the hustle and bustle of the crowds. And then another day I'll come down and I'll do it when the fair's in full swing. So you can see all the atmosphere, the lights, the sights and the sounds. So yeah. So as we walk on then, we walk past the wild mouse and normally just down here is a little dragon coaster. That's not here this year, but that has been replaced with a pirate coaster that we'll see over there. So we'll take a wander around. Just basically show you pretty much what's here. There's the skids, which is a bit like a waltzer, but not. It kind of just flings you around all the corners. Pretty good fun and excellent to watch as well. So make sure you do that if you come down. Proper old school kind of ride. So as we're walking around, we've got the accelerator. Some of the kiddies rides down there, along with some of the carnival games. Some waltzers and in the infinity there. That's a good ride, one I did last year. Probably do that again at some point this week. It doesn't invert, but you get a good ride on it. The crazy bulls, that's always good to watch. That's the little pirate roller coaster making its Goose Fair debut this year. So we'll come and check that out when it's in full swing. Here we've got the New York, New York, which is right next to Over the Falls bomber style ride. That was here last year, as was this bungee. Got a sizzler. One of the jumping smiles here as well. Here we do actually have a Bavarian style bar, has got indoor seating as well, looks like they've got extra seating as well at the back this, this year, that's not normally there, extra marquee. One of the big fun houses. Some of the vehicles up there. Ghost train. Got an Animal Kingdom stall there as well. Next to a Kentucky Derby and we'll, uh, we'll take a walk. Yeah, let's go anti-clockwise, so lots of stalls up there, but we'll go, we'll go anti-clockwise and walk this way. So again, another set of waltzers. Down here you've got a lot of food and a lot of game stalls. So as we move, there's a rotary wall there. Take a one up here. 
This is Ice Jet. This was here last year. Seemed quite a popular ride as well. There's lots, like, everything's just like in between each other, so you have to just like walk up and down all of the alleyways. You got games left, right, and centre to you. Another jump and smile. Taking card payments as well. Some more of the little kiddies rides nestled in between. Another one of the big fun houses. Some rifle shooting. There's one of the star flyers over there. Quite a tall one. Oh. You still got some of the old school traditional rides like the cake walk. Any helter skelters. Any helicopters as well. I think I remember going on them when I was a young lad. Not quite so young nowadays. <laughs> Yeah, this is what I mean, you, there's, there's lots packed in to the place and that's why I like to do these walkthrough tours and there's not many people here and the fair's closed so you can actually appreciate what is here and get a sense of like how everything's laid out so yeah lots of stalls, more games the sizzler on the many Miami style rides got the red devil there some more dodgems and waltzers this is another new one for goose fair this year the joker That's great. That's great with its purple and green. Wow. And that's quite a tall one. One thing to mention is a lot of the rides do take these money off of vouchers which can be found in the local Nottingham Evening Post paper there's the Red Devil Got Shaw's Fighter is here the Tornado 2 Got a couple of ghost trains up in the corner. I've seen this one at Ilkeston. It'll probably be there in a couple of weeks as well. I'll let you know because uh, I'll be down there. And the rain has just decided to well and truly come down now. So we've got another rotor wall. 
with a jumping smile. I'm going to do the outside and work my way back in to the middle bits over there. That's the Air Max, which I saw tested in one of my previous videos. Atmosphere, which is pretty much a, the same ride as Red Devil. I've got another Starfly and a bungee over there. Bob Wilson. He's here too. Stone Bonner style ride. You can drown when you have a giant octopus. Cool. That's where the uh, tram stop is, that's also one of the main entrances so you can get the public transport trams to Goosefear. Oh wow, I can smell the fudge. I just expect lots of Waltzes, dodgems, twists, sizzlers, whatever you want to call them. Coming down to the Super Bowl. This always has the same pitch here, it's, it's been here for as many years as I can remember to be fair. Good ride though. There's some good views of the fair when it's uh, when it's up. The extreme. Some more little food halls down there. You see the other spinning mouse coaster. Freak out. All that waiting to pull on in the very first video for the Goose Fair this year. Can win a puppy. Is at MD's big wheel. I'm not wrong, it is a big one. You see, there was Ice Jet where we were not too long ago. Time out just right, I get to see a little bit of testing. Again on that. This is the Midnight Express. And there's the second giant wheel.
and my Stargate all lit up already the Mexican Wave which is a, another jump and smile kind of ride and there's Proctor's Waltzers there a staple of Goose Fair Something's only a pound, but I, I don't know what it is. I'm back up towards where the Red Devil is now, so we're going to take a walk along the top up to where the uh, second Kentucky Derby is, and then we'll go down Food Alley. from the Joker part. Lots more stalls up there, games. This is where the main sort of bulk of all the, the kids' rides are. You can see the big fun house down there from earlier. And then back down there. Lots more stalls and games. Right, how you doing? How you been, right? And you walk up here into the... Uh, to where the food alley is. And there's the Kentucky Derby. Staple of Goose Fair Mushy Peas. Traditionally cooked. So you get all sorts up here. Grill house. Hog roasts, pork and stuffing cobs, Philly cheese steak, hard west barbecue, donuts, Jamaican jerk chicken, churros and craps. German sausage. Slushies. Wow. They look nice. Belgian chocolate cakes. Candy floss. Crepes for a Rossi chocolate. Let's do one. Kebabs. Loaded fries and burgers. Greek gyros, doner kebabs. Coffee. Group cheese, cheese toasties. Ooh, nice. I think I've seen that at Goose Fair before. I've seen them about, but not here. Churros, a load of donuts. Toffee apples and brandy snaps. Tornado potatoes and then Scout donuts and mushy peas Hope you enjoyed the whirlwind tour Walk around tour of the Nottingham Goose Fair there um, As I say we'll be coming down again to do a tour when the fair is in full swing with Rides on, lights on Probably in the dock so you can get a bit more of the ambience there um, If you like what we do, click like, hit subscribe, tick that notification bell Drop me a comment and we'll see you in the next video real soon. Take care.